Bash the teacher is finally back with a brand new update. I am about to prank my teacher so badly, it, it's it's gonna be bad. What is going on TFG squad? My name is Brandon and welcome back to Bash the teacher. So you guys have been asking me to play this game for a while. I said next time there's an update, I will be back. Well, there's an update with new teachers, new weapons, new pranks. So let's jump right back into this game. So here we go. This is my favorite school. I am the world's greatest pranker. And who's my current teacher? Oh, it's the uh, Tutor Bot 3000. Yes. They finally stopped giving me human teachers because they all hated me. So they gave me a robot. And now he hates me. All right, so here we go. Right now it's the robot. And what am I throwing at him? Oh, yeah, I'm throwing matches at him. Okay, I haven't played this game in a while. Um, I also have a lion for a pet. I think we named him Leo the lion, but I'm not exactly sure. And we've got a radio as our class item. All right, here we go. Let's go with prank number one. And actually, I think the TutorBot 3000 is about to quit. This actually might be... He just quit. Okay. So we are going to jump into the brand new teacher right away. What is the new teacher going to be? All right. TutorBot 3000 was defeated. I am such a bad pranker that even robots hate me. What do we got? What do we got? I just want to see what this new teacher is. So there are multiple... Oh my gosh. It's Co Coach Fleeble Bones. Okay. I have now unlocked a teacher named Coach Fleeble Bones. At least I think that's how they said it. By the way, if you guys want to see more Bash the Teacher on the channel, hit that like button and make sure you guys subscribe to the channel right now. All right, let's jump in. So I want to look at some of these new upgrades. So like I said, right now my item is the radio. Oh yeah, there's new items. Okay, so I can unlock a toaster or three other crazy things. My current pet is the lion and... Oh, I can, up I can upgrade to, like, a cute, adorable little bunny rabbit. And also three other pets. And for the weapons, right now I'm throwing matches, which seems pretty aggressive. And I can upgrade to ice cream cones or also three other secret weapons. Oh, this is going to be amazing. This is going to be absolutely amazing. All right, let's start pranking Coach Fleeble Bones. Oh, my gosh. I'm literally burning him. I can't tell if he has red hair or his head is on fire from my matches. Yeah, I can't tell right now. It's either his hair or just a giant flame on his head from the matches. We're, we're not exactly sure. All right, here we go. Prank number one is coming up right now. What's going to happen? Okay. Okay. That was not much of a prank. Coach Fleeble Bones, that was um, uh, very embarrassing on your part, okay? You do not have muscles. You should not be flexing them. And you know what? At this point, I'm actually surprised you are able to hold the piece of chalk above your head because your arms are so tiny. I mean, look at this guy. What is this guy a coach of? Being a string bean? Right? Like, you go to his class and he just says, All right, everybody, stand there and do nothing. You are now a string bean. Okay, you know what? Let's go right into an upgrade. I'm gonna upgrade to a new weapon. I want to throw ice cream cones at this bad boy. I want to throw ice cream cones at, at, at Coach Fleeble Bones. At least I think that's his name. Again, I'm not exactly sure. Okay, so let's go back. Let's go there. And the next one is a... Oh... I can start throwing, like, a chemical beaker at his head? Wow. All right, well, that just kind of sounds very illegal. But here we go. We're sticking with ice cream. What flavor ice cream is it? Let's throw it. Oh! It's, like, banana flavor. Ew! Oh, gosh. Actually, I think Leo the Lion kind of liked it. You ready? Yeah. Yeah, he definitely likes banana-flavored ice cream. Okay, this is disgusting, man. Ooh, have you ever heard of chocolate, vanilla, maybe cookie dough? I don't know. Let me know in the comments. What's your favorite uh, the, uh, flavor of ice cream? I'm asking for a lot in the comments today. Partially because I'm just very excited this game was updated. I've been looking forward to this for a while. All right, let's throw a few more banana-flavored ice cream cones at his head. And here we go with prank number two. Don't tell me I got the same one two times in a row. Oh, come on. What are the chances of that? That was just bad luck. Here we go. Let's unlock the real prank number two. In three, two, and one. Here we go. If he, okay, there we go. This is new. Oh, my gosh. Hey, it's all the other teachers. It was all the old teachers. 
Whoa! So we had Miss Thunder Punch. We had uh, Madam Pudding. We had uh, Bum Fluff. Professor Bum Fluff, I believe he was in the submarine. And you know what? I'm actually going to create a little lore in Bash the Teacher, which is kind of funny because I don't know if there's much lore in this game. They did not let the Coach Fleeblebones in their submarine. So um, I, I think that maybe the Bash the Teacher teachers do not like Fleeblebones. Either that or they're just like, hey, buddy, you are new. You are young. You deal with this kid. He pranks us every time. He throws matches at us, hammers at us. He gets these lions in the classroom and puts them in tiny cages. You deal with the prankster. We're going to be safe in our submarine. I think that might be what's going on. All right, here we go. Let's go back to throwing banana flavored ice cream cones. Look at this. The ice cream uh, the ice cream falls off the cone, and then you just see the empty cone bounce on the ground. That's actually kind of fun. All right, here we go. Next prank coming up. Basketballs are flying from the ground. Oh, gosh. He's already crying. Fleeble, but oh, knocked him out. We knocked him out cold with a basketball. Okay, apparently I must have had a net above the classroom and I pulled a string and basketballs fell from the sky. Yes, I told you I'm the best prankster in the world. Actually, I kind of like, I kind of, it's a fine line between, between prankster and and criminal. I, I mean, I was literally throwing matches at him before, so that kind of makes me a criminal right there. By the way, I am getting 1,212 points every time I throw an ice cream cone at uh, the, the, whatever his name is, Coach Bones over here. Fleeble Bones. There's no way. You're going to break yourself in half if you try to do that. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. Wait a second. Wait a second. No, 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 no. I'm not buying that. I am not buying that because for him to be so strong that he fell through the ceiling because he pulled so hard, he would have to be like a bodybuilder. There he is not his those arms are not strong enough unless it was the weight. Oh, maybe it was maybe it was the weight that was so heavy so it went through the floor. Okay, you know what? I'm back on board. <laughs> I am back on board with that prank. I think it was a good one. All right, here we go. I mean, the amount of ice cream that this guy has in his hair and his shirt and his shoes, it's got to be disgusting. And I love ice cream. I absolutely love ice cream. I have it almost every night, but I don't want it in my hair, okay? I do not want ice cream in my hair. All right, here we go. Next prank coming up. Oh, here we go again. Here we go again. So we've got, uh, yeah, we've got three of our former teachers that quit and basically uh, he drowns. Am I getting close? I have 433,000 stars. What do I need for another upgrade? Let's upgrade our pet next time. I want the cute, adorable bunny rabbit. It's 700,000 points. Okay, you know what? That's not a problem. That is not a problem. I am about 300,000 points away from that upgrade. And... Oh my gosh! I sawed my teacher in half! I literally just sawed Coach D Muscle Toothpick. I don't know his name. I forget his name. Uh, I'm gonna call him Muscle Toothpick because his muscles are smaller than toothpicks, okay? I literally just sawed him in half, okay? Now, I, I mean, if that doesn't make me a criminal, if that does not send me to jail, I am not exactly sure what will. All right, here we go. Back to throwing banana ice cream at his head. Is it banana ice cream? Maybe it's lemon. Maybe it's lemon ice cream. That sounds a little better, okay? I'm gonna be honest. That sounds a little bit better than banana ice cream. Okay, ugh. I don't, I don't think I would like that very much. All right, moving on. <laughs> moving on to the next prank. I'm, I'm like choking here. I'm laughing so much. Oh my. Really? I just sawed the man in half. He just went to the doctor and got himself super glued back together. Somehow he's still alive. And I decide to saw him in half once again. Another prank coming up right now. What do we got? Why is he crying now? What are you blowing your whistle for? What? What was the point of that? That wasn't much of a prank. It was just annoying. You just blew your whistle right in my ear, and now my ear hurts. All right, you know what you deserve for that? More banana ice cream in your hair. Yeah. Oh, I'm actually getting close. 
Look at the stars on the top right corner. I'm at 700. There it is. There it is. Let's upgrade to the new pet. All right. I loved Leo the lion. I thought that was a hilarious pet to have in a classroom. But I'm getting a cute, adorable bunny rabbit. Oh, and after that, I could get a turtle. Oh, I want a turtle. I definitely want a turtle. Oh, look at my new pet. It's a little bunny rabbit that is suspiciously the same size as the lion. I don't know if that was the world's smallest lion or this is the world's largest bunny rabbit, but I'm going to name this guy Billy the Bunny. Yep, it is Billy the Bunny. What sound does he make? Oh, that is an adorable sound. That is, that is an adorable sound right there. All right, you know what? Let's go back to throwing ice cream at our coach. And... There he goes again. You know what? That's actually kind of impressive to have arms that small. I mean, I am not a large person. In fact, I consider myself a very skinny person. And even my arms are bigger than our coach over here. I will be back for more pranks and more teachers in this game. Also, check out my other YouTube channel. It's called TFG Vlogs. And I will see all of you in the next video.